Anything else up here where you guys were? Oh. Purple. And up here. No go. Sniper oh, spot, one. boy. Perfect sniper spot. Alright, purple up there too. More gravel. This whole fucking dragon corpse is gravel stone. Like, grab it as much as you want. Okay, I'm gonna get over to that. Oh. Maybe a drop. Maybe. Doesn't seem like a viable jump. Let's try again. Second attempt. For the long jump. Try running. better. Maybe from the top of the, the height, roof. though. Yeah. The height. You need a good line and good elevation. Oh, I was too early, right? Way too early. Parkour, parkour. I mean, is it an intended jump? Or are you supposed to follow from, from over here? You know, I kind of wonder. Uh, okay, so let's try to get it, like... Nice. A. Fuck off. I am now telling Stone Keys to fuck off. That's it. Actively stop. Now's the time to find, like, a giant imp with 30 holes inside. I mean, well, the more the better. Make a few. <laughs> This gate only needs two. Stab, 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 stab. <laughs> the eyes, nose, mouth. Yeah, it's just a weird, it's just a weird progression in, in in you know how you think about them at the beginning of the game versus what they become now. You know, like they're such a precious door opening resource, and then they just become that. Um. Okay, so front door. Came back that way. Went over here. Up the branch. And beyond. Yeah, this is a this is a scrapeless scrapeless push into into the capital. Uh, you seem to be alone. Hello. Hey. Of course. Of course you would be. Whoa, look at them go. Not buried in the ground over here. Well, not from here, eh? Because you're on the branch. Uh, yeah, gonna have to come around on that one. Grenade! Good job. That line, though. Hmm. 
everybody. Oh, he's fast. Nah. Nah. Just chilling. Okay, well, look, if you're just going to give it to me, then I'm just going to take it. I bet you this is going to fail. The, the, I bet you the angle sucks. But it'd be really cool if it did. No. The angle oh. sucks. <laughs> Interrupted. <laughs> oh no. Uh, that would have been fun, though. Right there. Half health. It's okay. We just don't want dumb jumps. Yeah, don't fall. I'll take. I'll get stabbed as many times as needed. Uh, we got a branch going down this way. To nothing, right? Uh, it curves inside. Well, it looks like it leads down to that oh, yeah, platform curves. where the person was walking. Uh -huh. Um. So two paths. And then a bunch of you guys over there. And then all, flowers. It all comes together. All right, let's go up first. Yeah, you know, I think... Um, Comet was the wrong spell for that. For that kind of lineup, just grenade him. Oh. to the item. Likely item. Yep. That would make sense. Seek trap. On the right. Holy well, grease, the item that we were seeing. From that bottom branch. Okay. It's like the ultimate treehouse. What kind of unbelievable blueprints does it take to build something like this? Whoa. The answer is fucking magic. <laughs> These are really golden plants, aren't they? Uh huh. Too bad you can't pick them up. Try lightning. Oh yeah. What? Oh what? Oh, we're doing it. What? Let's go, baby. Show me! Show me what it used to be! Show me what it was like at your prime! Let's fucking go! Godfrey, first Elder Lord, the legend himself. Stomp. Yo, he chopping, he chopping. Caught uh -oh. me. Final flask. Uh oh. Oh, it's gonna be close.
We do it the fun way. So close. We do it the fun way. <laughs> we do it the fun way. Okay, does this take your body? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god, I was not expecting that. Nothing but fists. Yo. Okay. Godfrey deserves okay. nothing but the best. Are you serious? Hell yeah. Exactly how I want it. Yo. Into the corner. Oh, that second one. And the chaser. Mm. Youch. Woo! Air footsies. Careful. Just a tip. Talisman pouch. Bow to the first Elder Lord. That's all it was, man. An axe and some fucking moves. Chunky. Some muscles. Hell yeah. Pure. There's no warning. No, just, oh, what's going on here? <laughs> Godfrey Just chilling over here Okay So uh, Why was your spirit Or how was your spirit Just Just chilling over here Hmm When you came missing or so, gonna spend it. Uh, yeah. So Newman's was twelve five. All right, I believe so. so. One of these. Yeah. No spells, no, no incantations, nope. just the axe. Just swinging. Our axe was clean too.
by saying 2k. Two hundred still. Oh, my God. All right, now we cool. Well. To call an Elden Lord, technically, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I guess you belong. I guess so. <laughs> um, didn't drop a remembrance though. Nope. No remembrance. No gear. Just the pouch. Which gives you three. We'll fucking take it. Ah, that's nice. That's nice. That's You're nice. You're even more powerful now. What do we want to equip? Four goddamn ring slots to 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 do anything. Uh, I mean, shit. Sky's the limit. Uh huh. HP, restoration, HP, raise maximum FP, FP restoration, stamina max, hmm. raises. We got plenty of stamina right now. Yeah, right? I got stamina's alright. Mm -hmm. um, mm, maximum HP, stamina, and everything. A little bit of everything. Right, this was a nice early one. That wasn't too bad. Mm -hmm. Um. Boys ain't bad. Um, boy, okay, and then the scar shields, which yeah, squishier. Strength, dex, int, faith. Into seventy nine by five, basically, right? Five points into each one. Yep. Um. Physical damage negation mm -hmm. greatly boosts. How am I putting damage. on? I have the wrong one on. No, it's plus one. Never mind. It was correct. Uh, spell Drake, Flame Fire, Drake, Lightning, Holy, non physical, non physical, and then some modeled thing. Yep, the individual ones. resistances, Vit, and then the attacking ones, um, which couple of the, like the jump attack one is always like you know I use a lot of those so uh, that could come in handy um, power of sorceries incantations memory slots spell casting time <sighs> roars perfumers oh mm. lowers FP of consumed skills Mm -hmm. Enhances charge spells. Mm -hmm. Um, man, I don't know. Uh, poise. I like the idea of more poise a lot. I like the idea of taking more as I'm laying in. Okay. Five points and poise is all right. Of course, clothing always makes the difference too. Um. Attack power with lower equipment load. Fire, lightning, holy. Dodge rolling. Headshots. And then, yeah. Hyper mode stuff. HP maximum. Crits. Successive attacks, comboing. This one does good oh, for my build. for the punches would be great, actually. Yeah. Because you like to punch. Um... This one makes... This one was necessary for Moog, for example. 
Mm. Right? The momentum of like boom, 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 boom. Like keep the Dempsey roll going. Yeah. Um, that pays off a lot for the 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 speed at which I attack. So Whoa, what was that one? This one? Um, yep, Kindred of Rot's Exaltation. Poisoning or Rot in vicinity increases attack power. Okay, so it was, the Rot will still hurt you, right? But you're going to do more damage. More damage. Okay. Not what I was looking for. Okay. Um, yep. Ancestral Spirit Horn, the free FP returns. Increased Ruin returns. Uh, silence. Crouching. And then the, the multiplayer items. Um, I'm leaning towards my, my fucking my jet engine. Okay, yeah. I think that's a good pick. You know? I was thinking maybe that or the one that enhance, enhances charge sorceries. Yeah. Okay, this is more but likely I'm, to be used. To it is. It is. And the way I'm I'm going through this, too, is I'm going to be throwing more punches out than spells. Yeah. So, uh, I think that makes sense. Not bad. Thank you, uh, Elden Lord. Huh. Okay. Well, no clear answers. Just a nice long room with a balcony mm -hmm. at the end. What's this? Dead guardians. You know what this room kind of reminds me of ever so slightly, but it reminds me a bit of uh, old King Alan's room. In that, like, imagine you come in from the far end. I thought about that. And then you have the balcony thing, yeah. on the other side as well. Are they? Are, are they guardians? These? Uh, are are they finger crones or guardians? That's what I'm wondering. I thought they were guardians, maybe. but the back. I think they're finger crones, maybe. I, I, I think they might be finger readers. Maybe. Uh, yeah, they are. Yeah, they are. They totally are. Yeah, when I was looking at them. it for a second. Yep. Yep. Rock ahead. Died in worship. Okay. This is where they congregate. Or at least they used to. Damn. Yo, Godfrey, how many grandmas, dude? All because they think you're cool. Nothing here. All right. Futility ahead. Oh, there's a branch there. Mm -hmm. And then branch goes uh, up and down. Yeah. This is massive. Yeah. Uh, let's just go over that way for a second. Hey, yo, Godfrey, what about Godfrey? We don't we talk don't about Godfrey. Godfrey. <laughs> who, 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 who told you that? Should have been erased from history. <laughs> Either that or like the fight starts and the life bar pops up and it's just like G O D F R asterix. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, who the fuck? Uh, <laughs> who? Mm. <laughs> no. <laughs> Front gate. Uh, okay. Could have walked in from this side. 
Hmm. And got it from the front. But instead, we got it from the side. Wow. All of this is connected. Yeah, we got it from the side. Or could we? Hmm, the branch goes up and there was that... Yeah, hold on a second, I think I'm... Mistaken. Okay, so we got a, an elevator up there. Uh, no, never mind, never mind. No, 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 no. We're supposed to progress out this way. For a second, I was reading this as uh, the pathway up that. Yeah, okay, no. You couldn't climb that. No, okay. So you couldn't come through the front door, no matter what. You can go down, but you can come up. Yeah. Um, okay, well, before we take that elevator, uh, let's let's hit the branch on the other side, and then... Because that clearly looks like progress. And then there's the actual hillside. I'd be very shocked if this little branch here turned out to be hard progress. This one? Mm-hmm. Last wood. Hey, what's up, Lithe? Uh, oh. Uh, <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Uh oh, it's going higher. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Uh, either one, really. <laughs> that could go either way. All right, let's take a little look. See what's Is happening over case? here. Is it? I don't see the particles. Yeah, no particles. Oh, there it there is. There it is. Okay, it is a grace. Whoa. Oh, Black Knife Assassin. How you doing? What's up, lady? True that. Let's dance. The arabesque flow. You all are dancing. First blood. What, my briars don't count? <laughs> no passive abilities. Oh, shit. Ooh. I thought you flipped over the- For a second? <laughs> oh my god. For a second? <laughs> Nice paint. <laughs> Royal Rumble. But you opened up your guard. Hey. <laughs> nice little dance. Always a pleasure. Respect. Giving that toast. The Bloodhound dance <laughs> is the sickest shit ever. Always toast. Stacked bricks or tiles. Ela, I was gonna say like tablets, but. Well, this looks important. I'm gonna bet... Runark. <laughs> Visions of Pear. What? 
chamber is this. Queen's bed chamber. Makes sense. Makes sense. And what does a queen's bed chamber contain? Blessing of the Erd Tree. Is this... Do these sheets smell of Marika? No. 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 That's a big seat. No. Uh, I wonder if, if she's that big. God damn it. Not facing the right way. <laughs> there you go. <sighs> Is it comfy? Faith 38. Grants greater blessing to self and nearby ally, gradually restoring a large amount of HP. Hold to continue praying and delay activate activation. The earth tree once flourished with abundance, yet it was only for a fleeting moment. Such is the course of all life. Did we just pick up like this and like the other two healing things from uh, Gideon as well? Are there like eight healing options? Mm -hmm. Never die. For incantation. Life. Seems so. The Urchi once flourished with abundance, yet it was only for a fleeting moment. Hmm. Kind of like the Erd Knight when it when it gets all uh, rune bonused. I'm a I'm a queen. Sure, I can take a nap here. No treasure chest ahead. And then onward. Another fuck. And world. then onward to some real shit. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Well, I appreciate that fog door. Uh-huh. Telling us what's up. So I can mentally... Pump the brakes. And go see what's in the other direction. We're going down the branch this time? Or somewhere else? The elevator? Aha, uh -huh. okay. There's also a little bit over here. Door ahead. Oh, okay. Up there. Here. Treasure hey. chest. Why is it always bow? <laughs> or a tree bow. Well, we've been hearing about that one for the entire game. So, uh, fine. Faith bow. Long bow featuring earth tree styling. In times of old, when faith and battle went hand in hand, this weapon was created in tandem with a golden arrow. Scales all arrow damage with faith, revealing its true worth when used with holy infused arrows. Mm -hmm. And we've got the arrows for it. 14 faith. Nice. I wonder if that's the best bow. With a name like Urtree Bow, you would hope. You know? You'd hope. <laughs> Cheaply manufactured Urtree Bow, just the name is good. Necessary item ahead. That was a branch. Yeah. What about this? Oh. And a ladder. Oh my god, it keeps going. Oh my god, it keeps going. That's so big. Ooh. What is that? Necessary item ahead. Okay, okay. Golden Order Principia. And you are just hanging on top of someone. Uh, what? There's a tiny body on the thing. Oh, yeah. No, I. So I am like, yes, there's a person sitting there, but I thought you were saying on top of like Godfrey, who was there. No, no, anyway, no. yeah. Um, are you? 
I thought you were like a perfumer for a second, but uh, it could just be a granny with a cover. A book? A book in the lap. What is this? Give to a learned cleric to acquire new incantations. Prayer book of the Golden Order Fundamentalists, a dense and complex academic treatise that contains the order's fundamental principles. Can learn radical hey. ring of light and law, law of, of regression. regression. The laws. I hope that's it as well. Uh, I'm going to say it probably is if it's fundamentalist. I wonder what Corin's going to say. Radagon's ray of light. He's going to call it blasphemy. <laughs> it's Radagon's rings of light, dude. Give me those laws. Mm -hmm. Okay, so... Huh. Ladder over there. Ladder down to things. Right? <sighs> right. Yeah, you're trying to remember all the paths? Yeah. Okay. Ladder down to things is over there. Whoops. No, that's correct. That's fine, that's fine. And then there's the cliff over there. Not too deep. Night ahead, huh? Gorgeous view. Nice on the side. Statue. Radagon. Ripped. Regression alone reveals secrets. Dev message. Damn. Do you think... Law of regression? Yeah. Do you think we have to... Do a little detour? Try incantation, of course. Likely behind. So it seems. So it's time seems. for a hole. Try fingers, but hole. Anyone besides Corin we could give it to? <laughs> uh, uh I don't know. Okay. Who, who could help us? Uh, he's the only incantation trainer besides D that uh, I can think of, and quite frankly, uh, that makes him currently the only one. Uh, so you were in that little bridge area. Not there, but there. Regression. Our favorite part of QA. <laughs> Reopen. <laughs> it's not fixed, guys. QA is breaking everything! No, that's not what we do. That's not what QA we does. We find the mistakes. We find the mistakes. <sighs> They're gone. They're gone. Both of them. They're both gone. Please don't be on the floor. Gold mask moved. And Korra moved with him. Entering the capital as a trigger. Ooh. Totally possible. And... So 
find him. We can't. No, that's our trainer. Oh my god. Wait, hold on. Hold on. That's not true. That's not true. I lied. I think Turtle Pope can. The turtle can do that? Turtle Pope can do both. Okay, well then. We're good. We can forget that, that other dude. Who? <laughs> turtle Pope does both. Greetings. Do you need anything? They fucking moved on, dude. They moved on. Yeah. Yeah. Here you go. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh, -huh. uh you can have whichever ones you want, my oh, friend. What have we here? Very well, let us both learn together. Heresy is not native to the world. It is but a contrivance. All things can be conjoined. Corin saw us down the bridge coming with a fundamentalist book in our hands and is like, I'm out. Oh, what have we here? Very well, let us both learn together. Heresy is not native to the world. It is but a contrivance. <laughs> All things can be conjoined. Thank you, Muriel. Cool. Thank you. The Lord's Heal. Ooh. Massively heals HP for self and nearby allies. 20 faith required. Incantation bestowed by the two fingers upon the tarnished deemed worthy of becoming a lord. Yo, uh, tarnished, oh tarnished. Tarnished, oh tarnished. Seek the earth tree and stand before Marika, its queen. Become the Elden Lord. Become the Elden Lord. Mm -hmm. And then Lord's Aid. Incantation by the two fingers again. I leave its buildup of poison, blood loss, and sleep for the caster and nearby allies. Additionally, cures poison. Mm -hmm. It does everything. Radagon's Rings of Light. What a thumbnail. Wow. That's the pose. The T pose. Yep. Dominant. One of the incantations of the Golden Order Fundamentalists. A gift of gratitude to the young Michaela from its father, Radagon. Mm. So Michaela, a gift. son of Radagon. Yes. A gift for Michaela. Okay. Okay. Produces a golden ring of light and fires it across a wide area. Charging enhances range. And yet, the young Michaela abandoned fundamentalism. For it could do nothing to treat Malenia's accursed rot. This was the beginning of unalloyed gold. Uh -huh. Okay. So Radagon, uh, Big Dick G, goes and has a big old family. We get uh, Radon, Rikard, and, and Raddy as he hooks up with Renala, leaves. Um, and then, uh, when he switches sides and respects for that faith, uh, we get Michaela and uh, Melania. Uh, uh, Melania, rather. And he abandoned fundamentalism because it couldn't help her scarlet rot condition. So she flowered. But even before she flowered, she still had that within she her. The rot, yeah. She she flowered in the fight with uh Radon. With Radon. Right? Was she suffering before the fight? I mean if Was she fighting and being a badass while being accursed with the rot? If Millicent is the same condition, then look at her state. Right? She's just oozing it the whole time. And, uh, yeah, it seems like Mel Michaela wanted to fix that for her, but couldn't find the answers in fundamentalism. Okay. Um, furthermore, like, Radon and, and I mean, it, it, we knew this, but Radon and, and uh, uh, millennia fighting is like straight up um, uh, 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 step family stepsister stepbrother not no wait what's the relation 
Yeah. Between, Second. Between which? Um, yeah, no, Step, right? Between which characters? Between um, 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 uh, Radon and, um, and Millennia. Um, they would be Step siblings, I guess? No, half siblings, half, half? siblings. Um, uh, step is when they marry in and okay. then you uh, uh, from the opposite side. They'd be half siblings, yeah. Which is what I have a bunch of, actually. Yeah, so they're they're half they're half siblings. And Um Unalloyed Gold, has that appeared before? Like the needle that was used to uh, cure rot. medicine. Yeah. Unalloyed go- gold is how Kills you stop rot. Is yeah. It cures rot. And it's used to stave it off, is what it said, right? Yeah. Uh, the fire staves is off, right? Um, the description of, of the needle that you read earlier today okay. mentioned something about that. But uh, let's pull it up. Because that would seem likely then that Michaela did find his answer after turning away from this. Radagon brought the golden tailoring tools and the gold swing needle when he married into the carrion line with Renala. He brought that with him. Uh-huh. Okay. Aside from that, frozen needles. Find the unalloyed needle in the swamp. That was our mission. Mm-hmm. And then we find it. We found it. Mm-hmm. Um, wards away the meddling of outer gods forestalling the incurable rotting sickness. Okay. So seems reasonable then to say at this point in time that um, I mean if all the other kids he had didn't have Scarlet Rot then it came from mom. Right? So Marika the outer god comes through right is the Empyrean is following the will of the greater will um via the fingers um and uh if if the uh oh hold on am I getting am I getting that wrong uh because I was gonna say that like if the um if the Scarlet Rod is being listed as, like, the meddling of outer gods, then basically uh, it came... Uh, hold on, th- th- am I getting that wrong? Um, 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 ra- ra- again. Radagon, ra- Radagon leaves um, 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 Renala for, uh, for, America. for America, right? Yeah. Right, so, and then after he's with America, they have the twins, um, Michaela and um, Millennia. Millennia, and Millennia is born with the Rot, um, if the, if that according to what you just read, um, the rot, if the, if that's being like if, if that's being described as like the meddling of outer gods, then um, that would be the Marika's. Is the meddling of outer gods? Okay, L- sorry. Let's just back it up. Let's just back it up and let's re- let's uh, read that read that again. About the, the about the he the took the needle with him. Needles, right? Um, I don't know if the unalloyed gold needle is the same as the golden tailoring tool and gold sewing needle. Okay, that Radagon brought. So it might be a different one. That's okay. All I'm trying to say to just skip forward to the. the I was trying to walk through the steps, but I'm like, all I'm trying to skip to is that um, Marika was the so- Marika is the reason why millennia uh has scarlet rot right it seems like that's a likely case if um she was born that way perhaps and uh if we don't know yet but um what you just said about the about the unalloyed gold needle being used to to hold to to like deal with scarlet rot and the link of mentioning outer gods it's like why would outer gods be mentioned in that Okay, that's a lot of info. Um, okay. Malenia. Okay, first of all, like, when you say Malenia is born with the rot, I'm like, when did we see that? We didn't see it. I don't know that. Okay. Right? All right. So, so here, here's what I'm... Here's what I'm... I'm, I'm, I'm and and I, this all... 
So I might be super wrong, but I'm I'm just going like, okay, if. Okay. <laughs> Let me just work my thoughts. You backwards. have the mic. All right. So we saw over here that um, this pathway of Michaela, we this taught us that Michaela wants to fix Millennia's accursed rot. Yes. This teaches us that he abandoned fundamentalism because he um, um, he couldn't solve the problem that way. Therefore. Um, him doing that was the beginning of unalloyed gold, right? That's okay. what it says right there. Yeah, him. You remember, to... yeah, that unalloyed gold was the way to fight against Scarlet Rot. Yes, because of the description that says, uh, "Unalloyed gold needle wards away the meddling of elder gods, forestalling the incurable rotting sickness." Okay, the incurable rotting sickness is Scarlet Rot. Yes. Okay. So the meddling that this is the meddling. The meddling of outer gods, of outer gods. Messing with stuff. The meddling of outer gods yeah. equals scarlet rot. This is what I'm trying to say. Okay. Right. Okay. So there um, were were see, we're using. Okay. So now when I think of outer gods, um, what do we what do we have in terms of outer gods being mentioned? Didn't we have at some point a mention of Marika coming from uh, b outside the lands between? Uh, I do remember and I, something. And like did that. she not arrive uh, from the Greater Will on a comet? Um, or was that a, a speculative thing that we kind of left open? So for Alder Gods, there's the online old if gold not, needle that mentions it. Forget the last part of what I said, but like, was not was there an item description that mentions that she arrived uh, from outside the lands between? Well, the Newman stuff, I think. Let me Google Newman. No problem. Google. <laughs> Look up Newman. The Newman came... That's a description for Newman's rune, by the way. The Newman came from outside the lands between, same stock as Queen Marika herself. Thank you. Okay. Therefore, because of that line, I assume that Marika, from outside, uh -huh. is also an outer god okay. that arrived in the lands between. Right? Okay. Okay. So now, with that bullet point down, I'm saying her daughter has Scarlet Rot. An outer god had a daughter who has the thing that is the meddling of the outer gods. This is that's what I was trying to okay, do. Okay, that's the thing that you're doing. That's what I was trying to 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 say. Okay. We could be missing ingredients there. We could be missing information. But I'm just going like what you just said says the outer gods and Scarlet Rot are mentioned in the same sentence, the meddling of outer gods. So uh, if it's not caused by Marika being an outer god, then it could be caused by literally other outer gods. We don't know. But okay. that was a thought that crossed my mind as you were reading that. Okay. That's all I was trying to say. Okay. All right. Um, and then we need some money to buy these things. Uh, yes, yeah, 17,500 if you want to buy these two. Uh, oh yeah, and the Law of Regression that we need. Yep. Another Golden Order Fundamentalist Incantation, one of the key fundamentals. Heals all negative statuses, dispels special effects, and reveals mimicry in all its forms. The Fundamentalists describe the Golden Order through the powers of regression and causality. Regression is the pull of meaning, that all things yearn to eternally converge. Hmm. The opposite of the law of thermodynam the second law of thermodynamics, right? Instead of entropy, it, it's all coming together. Um. Okay. Well, let's cash in. Uh, thirty-seven faith required on this heals uh, uh, all. Wait, wait. Look again. Thirty-seven faith. Uh, sorry, not faith. Int rather. Excuse me. That's for us. Yes. So that, that's what I meant to say. Thirty-seven int required, so the laws can be used. As long as we equip a um, seal to do it. Yeah, laws are intelligent. All negative statuses, dispel status effects, reveals mimicry in all its forms. Uh, that's a really good reason to carry around 
<laughs> a seal. That's a better reason than the law of causality. Um, wow. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. I'm convinced. Um, and, of course, oh yeah, you know, it said this, Lord harbored a secret. this, yeah, it's had a statue, right? Sculptor of the Erd Tree capital was Skeleton. summoned to render Lord Radigan's likeness in giant stature. Yep. When he glimpsed the skeleton in Radigan's closet. And as such, it said the great statue harbors his secret too. And that's what we're going to uncover. Thanks, Muriel. Oh. Um. Yeah. And I know that, like, even if it what doesn't bear repeating that um, if I'm speculating and anything I'm saying is wrong, then it's speculation. We'll find out in due time and it'll be okay. Is there something else? I saw a lot of nays flying while I was talking, so it is what it is, but uh We're going to need 10, 7, 4, uh, 11, 12, 13, 14, call it 15, and we're going to need like, yeah, just above 30. So, uh, 12, 12. Plus a little bit more. Wait, hold on. Let's just get precise with it. Is some okay, we're good. Oh! Damage over there. Anyway, I want to get all the incantations on my body, just so that I can, uh, you know, be ready for a new game plus. Anything interesting in the control F? Um, not that I can find worth mentioning right now. Unless you were looking for something. Trying to see what information we have on Marika. No, I just, uh... Yeah, once I see you scrolling through the notes for an extended period of time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm curious what uh, what you're pulling up there. <laughs> yeah. yeah. We don't know enough about Outer Gods to put a finger on, you know, um, on, on, um, oh. Oh, the sun. It's Thank you. Time. Yeah. We don't know enough about Outer Gods to put a finger on um, the exact nature of, of uh, Marika and Scarlet Rot, but like um, that that link does make me wonder, you know, because when you think about like the fact that like Radagon sired a whole lot of kids, but none of them were afflicted with it until her you know so we're trying to piece together perhaps why and uh anyway I imagine more to say once we cross the lake of fucking rot <laughs> right yeah Ugh. and then on the other side of that I have to think about um uh so yeah this Incantation, which is made for Mikella. I wonder if doing it in front of them would result in anything interesting happening. And a gravel stone seal requires 18 faith. Uh, what other seals? Right, we had access to the finger seal. Oh, 
Oh, that one was actually better. The Garank one. <laughs> um... Oh. I'm silly. I'm silly. What's up? I forgot to actually equip the incantation. Oh. Only human. Might want that to stick around. Um, and the other law of causality was retribution, right? Yes, that's what it was. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Heal all status effects might be something nice. The only problem is, like, the panic of getting over to this and this and in the middle of a, a situation where I need to be cleansed. Mm. Um... Might be difficult. Like, healing all status, status effects would be, uh, something to throw on when you're, like, trying to not pop bleed or trying to not get rotted. And you'd have to be very quick about switching over to both. <laughs> Dude, it's a cool monk pose. It really is. Strong foe over there. Okay. Got it. Okay, so what did the famed sculptor see? Close enough? Let's do it from where the sign tells us. Yeah, that's fair. There it is. Okay. For a brief moment. That's Marika. And... Huh. Hold on a second. We're out. Huh. No, you just had to do it once. Okay. So it's changed. And what else? 
You saw the you saw the um, the particles, right? Mm -hmm. They flew off. Let's grab that. Totally watch it in a second. Radagon is Marika. What? Okay, my brain is like, I uh, doesn't understand what's going on right now. Okay. We've been lied to. Openly. Um... I was like, the statue changed. Is there going to be some opening that yeah. pops up somewhere? Yeah. But no, the message changes. <sighs> Radagon is Marika. From which point? Okay, okay. Now we have to pull it up. Now we have to pull it up. Um, control F for... Um, for, um, oh my god. Oh, Jesus Christ. I mean, they're holding the same pose throughout the entire game, close enough. They're both doing the Christ. Okay. I'm so confused. Okay. So, 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 um... Okay, let me just scratch an itch that might have nothing to do with any of this. Can you control F for the greater will? Sure. Sure. Okay. What the fuck? What the fuck? Actually, what? <sighs> Mad taint of newfound strength triggered by the shattering, a war which no lord arose leading to the abandonment by the greater will. What was the start of that? Uh, mad taint of newfound strength. Mad taint of newfound strength. Okay. Triggered the shattering. A war from which no lord arose leading to abandonment by the greater will. Okay. And then the second time it pops Next, up. Next, greater will. Fingers are envoys of the greater will. Yep. Um, the greater will has renounced the demigods. Um, right before that it says that the finger reader says the great runes are the stuff of demigods children of the goddess Marika vessel of the Elden Ring but the offspring are tainted by runes warring that none could become the Elden Lord the fingers say the greater will has long renounced the demigods Next. It's children of the demigods, children of Marika. Right? Right. Okay. Children of goddess Queen Marika, yeah. Um, and, 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 like, um, we know that's Michaela and, um, Millennia, who supposedly was when Radagon left, but, uh, now we're just fucking flipping that all around. Um,. Oh my god, I need to watch that intro again, too. <laughs> so that, that, what you just read is from which description? Um, this was when checking the room with the two fingers and meeting Enya, the finger reader. Mm -hmm. And she interprets the rose as a finger in the voice of the greater will. Okay. And then the great roots are a shard of the Elden Ring. And the finger reader says that the great runes are the stuff of demigods, children of the goddess queen Marika, vessel of the Elden Ring. 
and the offspring are tainted by the runes, none could become the Elden Lord. So the greater will has renounced the demigods. Okay. Uh, aside from that... America, of course, being the Imperium here. Um, and like we just reviewed, came from outside the lands between. Um, what I'm looking... Can you find the... Um, and again, this might be completely unrelated, but I just want to reread it. Um, can you find... Greater Will long ago sent a golden star bearing a beast yes. into the lands between. Yes. Which would later become the Elden Ring. Yes. Okay. Right. Right. That. Okay. So that became the Elden Ring. There we go. That's that's what I was looking for. Cool. Talk. Uh, oh, yeah. And then, and then we talked about Marika being potentially a vessel for the Elden Ring. Well, did we say that? But... but no. No. That was... Who said that? Who said that? Elden Stars. That's when we were checking the description that we're talking about the star falling mm -hmm. into the lands between. Mm -hmm. And then I said the rune arc, which is a lower, the lower arc of the Elden Ring might be part of a star. And then we talked about Marika being a vessel of the Elden Ring, carry of its vision. Yes, that, 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 right? So, like, basically, coming for, so coming from outside the lands between uh, seems to equal uh, coming from space. Um, and furthermore, like, uh, sent by the greater will, um... You know, we're we're currently creating a, a a hierarchy based on the way Rani talked about it, where um, the greater will commands the fingers, and then the fingers uh, choose an Empyrean, right? Or or more specifically, choose a demigod that then advances to become Empyrean. The conversation with Rani's doll. Yeah. She talked about how she had her two fingers, and then there were other two fingers, uh -huh. and she's at war with her two fingers because she doesn't want to, um, she doesn't want to follow what the two fingers uh, wanted for her. Yeah. So she sacrificed her flesh. Exactly. To to not have to follow what what it wants for her or whatever. Anyway, so all of that conversation was where. Um, and again, none of this was confirmed, but we were just speculating that, mm -hmm. like... Um, Maybe America was a pawn and not in control. Exactly. That's that's all. I, yeah, I was trying to call back to that point of, like, oh, maybe, you know, America is uh, uh, also stuck following the will, the greater will. Um, and what I guess I'm trying to narratively do here is make sense of, is it possible that she literally is the greater will and they're one and the same? And that, like, her connection to the Elden Ring is not just because, like, one begets the other, but because, like, um, the greater will sent in a comet that had a beast that then became the Elden Ring, and she's tied to that. Is it that literally... Or, or, like, is it possible they're one and the same? Or does that make the whole narrative fall apart? Right? Yeah, I think what, what I was laying it, on is that the, it the might star fall apart. became the Elden Ring, and it had a beast. It brought a beast, right. but the beast was not the Elden Ring. Okay, so... Ignoring all of that possibility, yeah. then, right? If we're just get, get, trying to make sense of this, then, like, more literally, uh, Renala and Marika had the demigods of the Carrion family. Um, because just just straight up replace Radagon in the story with Marika. Marika and Renala have, uh. Rikard, Rani, Rani. Radon, and then she leaves, and we were told that Radagon left for Marika, but if they're one and the same, then she leaves, and then there are other demigods that come from her, 
being the twins. Okay. So and now we just don't. Motivation. So now we're missing, like, how the twins were born, I suppose. <sighs> Basically, Renala and Marika have three kids. Marika leaves, and now we have another two demigods. One of which is they're both uh, capable of becoming Empyrean, whereas only Rani of those three was capable of becoming Empyrean. And one of them has Scarlet Rot, and the other one is whatever's happening with Mikella. We don't really know. But, like, what originally we thought was a second couple or whatever is now just, like, a single beat. Yeah, two people that were like, okay, no, bye. So... We have no idea what the actual lineage of uh, Millennia and Mikella is outside of, like, they came from America. And maybe when you're a god, that's enough. Maybe you don't, maybe you only need one person, you know? Man, I'm not going to sleep right tonight. It's, it's very unclear and confusing. Um, what? I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. I'm not gonna sleep okay tonight, that's for sure. And this is all, like... Talking about characters... Ex that, like, are not even... We're not even talking about, like, the G family. You, you know? Like, we're talking about the... Yeah. Radagon, Maletma, uh, America. America lineage. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Oh. Okay. What is this? <laughs> okay. Radakon is Marika. I want to go do a million things besides this, but we're gonna just do it. Uh, <laughs> I want to go figure out a million things right now. I want to go stare at the paintings. I want to go stare at the painting in the round table hold. The, the first one or the second one? <laughs> Which hold? The first one. <laughs> it's in both. Oh, there it is. Uh, we took the spell Oh, off. boy. Hey. Hey. What's up, buddy? Down to dance. Have a little fun. Nice, in and out. <gasps> Swing and a miss. Handled. Handled. Clean. Plump salt. Pop up. Oh my gosh.
how are we going to do this? Here it comes. <sighs> okay, okay, I'll this thing here. There you go. These fists. Barrier of gold. My fists are the answer. My fists will do the talking. <laughs> uh huh. Faith 24. Greatly increases magic damage negation for self and allies. Earth Tree Worship Incantation. This incantation was used by the champions of the Earth Tree in the first and second Lyurnian Wars, during which the red haired Radagon joined the heroes' ranks. Everything. Everything must be called into question. I'm so confused by the by the the the, the timeline of um We've said this already, but to recap now especially. Three events. The founding of the Golden Order. The birth of the Erd Tree itself. And, um... Uh, let's say the creation of the Elden Ring and the arrival of Marika, right? Uh, the Empyrean, the, the higher deity deity that is that is worshipped and you know is basically like um yeah just the highest authority uh beyond uh uh when we talk about the two fingers and then the greater will of si or, of course but uh the timeline of how those things uh, uh fit together is is I, it's just I, I I'm not sure because uh you know, you kind of tend to think about, like, these events as if they were, like, like, dragons and lightning, and then suddenly, uh, Godwin and, uh, uh, uh friends, and also the tree and a ring and Marika, kaboom, explosion, and now we're all gold humans fighting against you guys, yeah. and now we are the... The, the people that rule the lands between, you know? Like, you kind of think of it as just, like, a one-two state of a being, but, like, it's not, because, you know, like, yeah, Radagon joined at some point. Um, okay, so, now, I guess, the, I guess the idea is just, like, you know, did Marika straight up, like, shapeshift and I'm, conceal I'm her conceal Maybe, her appearance hey, and I'm Radagon. I'm become so a sexy. yeah just became became Radagon and then went about his business that way you know is it a so, like the is it is it sorry it, like cuz the two cuz there's the, the options are that like it could be like she transformed and became the person Radagon or it could be that like um there's a historical conspiracy and it's all kind of like let's cover what happened covered and muddled and unclear you know when we're talking to Pope Muriel he said um, the Church of Vow is where there was a matrimonial bond between red-haired Radagon and Renala of the Full Moon Radagon was a great champion came to the lands at the head of a great golden host when he met Lady Renala in battle, repented his territorial aggressions and became husband to the Carrion Queen. Mm -hmm. When Godfrey, first Elden Lord, was hounded from the lands between, Radagon left Renala to return to the Earth Tree capital, becoming Queen Marika's second husband, King Consort, and taking the title of second Elden Lord. And then right after, we hear about Radagon's secret in the statue. Right. Also, um, we also heard about the conversation 
or not the conversation, rather, we had a piece of gear that talked about um, the conversations that uh, their, like, attendants were privy to. But oh yeah, the could, mask thing. But could never be shared. Yes. Right. Uh, it was some mask with like Let's bars go. across the yeah, face. Yeah, yeah, They were not. So like that mask made us think that there was more to that breakup than it seemed. Um. And then, don't forget about this one, which is a helmet that keeps the greater will out. Yeah, from the Eternal City, right? Yeah. Nox. The Nox being like, yo, get out of my mind. Uh, so keep that in mind, too. Okay, so uh, let's find that helmet. Uh, when yep. Radagon married Renala, he ordered Carrion Magic Perceptors to don these masks to make it clear that all of their matters were to be kept strictly private. Right. This one. So, this is what makes me sound like, uh, there's other, th you know, what did they discuss? Other things. Other secret things, you know? Um, and Radagon leaving to become... America's quote unquote second husband. Um, and that was when that was when Godfrey uh, was losing. Is that what is that what, is that what it said? I said again. When Godfrey was l losing the war, then Radagon left Renala's side. You met Yes. Yes. Okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah, they got married, and then Lord Aragorn was a... Wait, wait. Yes, Godfrey, first Elden Lord, was hounded from the lands between. Was hounded from the lands between. And Radagon left Renala to return to the Urtri capital, becoming Queen Marika's second husband, King Consort, and taking the title of second Elden Lord. Yeah, okay, it was just that first sentence I was trying yeah. to remember. Okay. <sighs> All right, well... Let's not rack our heads too hard over it. <sighs> I'm sure in due time. Boy, I feel like we're playing 13 Sentinels. Jeez. For a brief moment. Yeah. All that talk about straightforwardness, and it's like, that's a 13 Sentinels head fucking scratching moment. Yeah. Um, I'll tell you what. Like my, my head is, is breaking. And the statues of Marika and Radagon look different, right? They, but they're in the same pose. The ones same of Radagon pose. are ripped, shirtless, with the X's of the Elden Ring uh, sigil at his feet, and the ones of Marika that we see everywhere are, you know, just her, like the one we looked at over there, with yeah. the braid broken and the dress flowing beneath. Um, and the main thing is that they both are holding that. Christ air. You know? There's something in the back. I saw it. Okay. I just didn't want to drop Without off before. Well. Yeah. Checking. Good exploration. They're doing the Jesus. They look serious. Too bad y'all are weak. We never came on this side. No, we never got that close to the thing, right? The big giant spear thing? Yeah. Yeah. Uh oh. Let's 
things. Too far. Yep. <laughs> Get that archer. Oh, will you have time? I don't think so. Oh, trade. Good trade, good trade. Four, five, six. So that can happen. I didn't know that could happen. <laughs> I thought three was the max. I thought three was the max. Uh-oh. Six. We didn't go behind this either. Nice try, dude. <laughs> Gravel stone. Oh boy. This is massive. Golden room 13. Jumping. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, that's gonna suck. Seek fire. What the fuck? <laughs> What the fuck? Reggie, what the fuck? <laughs> I'm in my own head right now. I'm really sorry. I'm barely here. I'm, I'm not here. I'm barely here. I'm, I'm like... I'm here, but... I'm like calculating for like the last 20 minutes. <laughs> I'm like, is it... Is it... I can't, I can't hold it in anymore. What the fuck is Did going Marika on? Did Marika dress up as a man and it looked good? What is going on? What... What... Is it, uh, is it magic? Is I mean, it, I, I, I'll tell you this much. Like... Uh, what's up? Hey, yeah. Oh, fuck. Oh, together now. I see, I see. Okay. Yep, have fun. Have fun. So anyways... Uh, we paid a lot of attention to detail, <laughs> and, uh, you know, we've been doing... Ah! <laughs> it ain't safe, it ain't safe. Uh-oh. Oh, man. That's it. Take your time. Take your time. Oh my god. Jesus. All right. Fucking clown shoes. <laughs> Around the corner he goes. And then. <gasps> Back. Let's go. Ooh, I hurt. All right, you got time to heal. Come on, buddy. You know the road. Yeah. Whoa, that's jank. 
What would I was thinking? I'm just... <laughs> whenever you feel like it, dude. Whenever you feel like it. Jeez. Jesus. Christ. Marika's tits. Oh, <laughs> yeah, you can say that again. Like... Yeah, okay. Progression, right? Yeah, Progression. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Moving forward. Moving forward. Room 10. Heroes room 2. New. New. Yep. Okay. Yeah, like the bullshit that we are being hit with is a mere is a mere like patches cutscene. Um, the bullshit we are being hit with is like lies of omission. You know, um, sentences that are using names that are not necessarily different from people we've met before, but. <laughs> The, I feel like there's a, a lot of a lot of that, you know, like yeah. destined death, Garank, you know, what this that whatever, Rena, what, Michaela, Mik uh, what, Millicent, Malenia, what, Trina, huh? A lot of a lot of lies of omission is how we're being fucking rocked and rolled over here, but we're doing our best and we're putting the details together as much as we can from what we're given. But kind of like with uh, the hardest parts of, of the most painful parts of uh, those 13 Sentinel moments mm -hmm. where you're just like, you didn't even you, you, like the puzzle. You, there's, you, there's, you didn't have the puzzle piece and then there's you had it, but it was upside down and there was no paint on it. They forgot to print anything on that puzzle piece. And you're like, this goes where? <laughs> okay. It's a donkey? What? Oh, you're calling everybody. Yeah, okay. Okay. Uh, well, that's back to the main street, so we know... We know where that leads, and that's okay. Are you persisting? Yeah, you're coming. The others are fine. You'll just shoot? Okay. So way back this way, we also saw some of those knights. We also saw some rooftops for cleanup. Um, and then, of course, there is the big gate. Yeah, sure. Visions of flute? something more incredible. Are you practicing your flute? You are. <laughs> Someone there? I got the high ground. Not anymore. There you are. Dude? Yep. Keep on playing. Zamfir over there. Nothing but the fists. Bloodhound step is now just regular step. Out of juice. All right. And that staircase keeps going down. Is that Main Street? 
Yes, it is. And then I want to say that's where we came out of. Yeah, when we, we were there, right? Killed him, who was playing his music. Come on, do the big, do the big, no? you okay i was for a second like what the fuck oh you got range perfect opportunity for some other bullshit to happen as i ran over here like a dragon trap Put your runes. No joy ahead. Lie ahead. Lie ahead. No secret passage ahead, but praise the message. Okay. So I'm thinking the rest of this should be left up to the scrape. Um, which means anything I find in these corners, nooks, and crannies off camera, you'll have to forgive. That's fine. Rooftops, also. Since they seem to be just like cleanup, mm -hmm. you know? But you never know. Oh yeah, and the jump over there. Um, keep going on the left, where we just fought. There was a jump on the left. Towards right the there. item. Yeah. At least, I don't know if it's a jump. Oh, it might be a drop. There's a branch on top, right? Might be a drop, but... <gasps> it goes over the, the spear thing. Yep. So you drop from up there down to that, you collect that, then you drop down there. Is there a hole near the... If you jump on that, you're not going to get to that anyway. So uh, really your goal should be to get up there. Which uh, might be some rooftop shenanigans. Is the spear like near an opening when you look at the, um, the other side? Like, on the wall over there. Uh, doesn't seem to be like an opening. It's just like stuck in the wall, right? Oh, there's something here! Lord Soren's boat. Doesn't yeah, it doesn't seem, seem like, there's like it. Hand. I think it's up there. Okay. Gold, Gold item. Gold. Gold item. Yeah. And, you know, for all we kind of know, we've been up there before, but just didn't, uh, you know, fully internalize it. So here's what I'll do. Put a marker. Yeah. Just around here. Uh, and with that, where to? Teleport. Did we touch the teleport near uh, Fia's death place? Yeah, that's what took us to uh, Fortisax. The memory of... of uh, inside. We touched her and we went to fight Fortisax. But did we touch the teleporter next to it? Oh, I thought... Oh. You Do you know, remember? I we, went, we reloaded, she was sleeping, and then there was like, touch Fia. And then it was like, do you want to go inside the dream? You know what? You might be right. You might be right. Um, I think that's probably why... Yeah, um, 
Okay, uh, let's 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 go let's go double check that. Oh man, my brain is broken by what, the what, revelation. What made you think of that? You said teleporter, and I was like, "Oh, what about that other teleporter?" Yeah. Right. Should be a quick, uh, quick check to find out. Uh, is it the right grace? No. Yeah. So we didn't touch it, right? If I forget, if, I forget. You know, I I thought we did, and uh, but like, no. If that was actually just touching her body, then. Where does it go? Where did they want quick teleportation from? Nope, we certainly didn't do this. But we've been here, right? Have we? I don't recognize this. Oh, is it just the front door and then teleport in to the capital right after the first grace? Yeah, I think so. Okay. I think it's just here you go. Go to the capital. Okay. All right. Okay, well, that's done. Yeah. Yeah, then we go into the entrance. Here you go. Go okay. to the capital. <laughs> okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <sighs> yeah, that, that one pulled the carpet on me. That revelation, I'm just like... My 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 brain is tight. Yeah. My yeah. my head. Yeah. Like the sides right over here. It's, it's tight right now. That the brain like can fix squeeze squeeze the brain summoning pool whoever the fuck you are <laughs> Summoning sign. Hey. Yeah. Melina. Let's do it. Let's fucking do it. You'll get hype. Oh my god. She's gonna fight in battle. She's gonna fight. You okay. got a little burning dex weapon over there. Let's go. Show me. What up, girl? Alright. What kind of boss do we have here? Cutscene. Graceless tarnished. What is thy business with these thrones?
Thy kind are all of a piece. Pillagers, emboldened by the flame of ambition. <laughs> Have it read upon thy meager grave. Felt by King Morgoth. Ah. Uh, of all kings. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh -huh. Yeah, Morgoth was Margit the whole time. Name fuckery, barely concealing the secret once again. Uh-oh. That is cool. Beautiful. Oh, the delay. Oh. Oh! <laughs> Hell yeah. Yo! <laughs> no, you don't. No, you don't. <laughs> Just like last time. Okay. So, Morgoth, a.k.a. Ruler of the Capital, Margit the whole time. So... Terrible way to hide your name, first of all. But secondly, um... He's calling them all traitors. Memorial Outside said he killed a bunch of heroes. He's a fell omen. Oh, he's the omen king. He's the... well... <laughs> Has he fallen if he's... if he's still a king? What does it mean to be an omen? We still don't know. But... Um... A grave site marking the fact that the heroes that fell to his hand stat piled high, but the Earth Tree still stands. And he rules the land itself. He turned on it, like, what? We don't, you know, we just... We so does it mean that he is... Mm -hmm. on the side of the earth tree well if you are the cap if you are ruler of Lind Lindell then you should be yeah part of the order you should be on the side of the the golden order but um what the fuck does it mean that uh he's an omen more info required in the meantime Let's punch. Fight. With the throne right there. Ouch. AoE. Okay. Ooh, oh! look at that tree! Let's go. Nice. Uh-oh. You're throwing the kunais? Nice! That was cool, Melina. She's schmoving. I like that projectile. Ah. Oh my god. No, no, no. Bad timing. He's real. Sh 
shackled. What? Phase two. Nice, Mel. Nice. Oh, Red Blade. Command grab looking motherfucker. What is this? Music. Let's go. Ugh. On our side. More God's great rune. Remembrance of the Omen King. Wow. <sighs> okay. And the body for reals. And there it is. And there it is. Okay. Okay. Um. We're out of time. That's fair. We're out of time. Well done. Didn't expect we fall. Still no strong fall. I don't know what's going to happen when I walk forward, but we are running out of time. Can I just walk forward? Yeah, let's do it. Touch the wall of thorns. Impenetrable thorns refuse all. None, None may, may enter, enter the, the earth tree. tree. This is the entrance. And look, you can even see parts of the rune yeah, that needs to crosses. be re-put together. Exactly. You can see the crosses right there. That's the entrance. Of course it is. Of course it is. Melina, fuck yeah. Oh, good rain. Cleanse my soul. You're not standing around anywhere to talk to, are you? It doesn't look like it. Okay. Maybe if you sit. Uh, that's a good idea. After all, that's when she talks to us. Beautiful. Hello again, old friend. Allow me a moment to converse with you. You were unable to enter the Erd Tree, no? Prevented by the mantle of barbs. The thorns are impenetrable. A husk of the Erd Tree's being that spurns all that exists without. The only way to stand before the Elden Ring and become the Elden Lord is to pass the thorns. My purpose serves to aid in that very act. So I'd like you to undertake a new journey with me to the flame of ruin, far above the clouds, upon the snowy mountain tops of the giants. Then I can set the Erd Tree aflame and guide you down the path to becoming Elden Lord. Rolled medallion. Burn it down, she says. Let's go. She says burn it down. <laughs> A red mark was made on the map. I wish to journey with you once more to the flame of ruin, far above the clouds. Upon the snowy mountain tops of the giants, then I can set the Erd Tree aflame and guide you down the path to becoming Elden Lord. Wow. The fact that she says you couldn't get in makes me wonder if she probably she had some dialogue before we tried to get in. Was the grace there? Um, I didn't notice. If I didn't know before. The same. Wall, same. Yeah. Same. Uh, okay. All right. Unfortunately, we are 
all out of time. But we'll pick up exactly where we left off. Oh my god, my brain. 